Romelu Lukaku having another fabulous season. Now up to 10 goals in the league with that successful spot. Sitting sick, so no formality that the Rossoneri will win that. Inter Nola with victory here, and should Sassuolo do them a favour? Hey. And a couple of meetings between some of those main challengers, what they call scontri diretti in this room in terms of their credentials to stay in Serie A. All smile. On the spin, Romelu Lukaku has scored five goals in his last game. Deola, Acampora and Vignali are the other new faces for the publicly and privately you sense too. But results starting to go his and Inter's way. Certainly more than justifying his big salary at this moment in time. Up and running at San Siro. Inter against Spezia. One of whom is Romelu Lukaku. Just lifted it too much. But there was a touch. Important sliding challenge to deny the Belgian. The first sight of goal goes the way of the home side. Over the head of Brozovic towards Lautaro Martinez. Ismaili is back amongst. Young's done very well. Ashley Young nearly did it all himself. What a goal that would have been. Providel did get a fingertip to it. This is Brozovic, and still, just took too long in the end. Well dealt with by Terzi. Cleared only as far as Hakimi. Brozovic sends in the free kick. Providel came and then didn't get there. Lautaro Martinez had an empty goal. Just couldn't cushion the ball into the young again. Ricci keeps it moving. Acampora. Rosovic didn't play the ball, and he gets a yellow card for his troubles. The first caution of the contest. Good pace from Lukaku. Looking immediately. Deola, let's fly. And Handanovic can watch it wide. Here is Bastoni. Gagliardini. Young forward here, still Bastoni, left by Mora, I'm not sure who he thought was behind him. Perhaps just the weight on the pass suggested that it was intended for someone else. Young can stand up across, no one attacking the back pass. Nearly through towards Lautaro Martinez, good spot. Saw the run of the Argentine. Into a grateful two, Nicolò Barrel immediately knew that Young was on his way forward. The Englishman just plenty of teammates in the middle for Hakimi. Coverdell under challenge with Lukaku. I'm not sure the Belgian did much wrong there. Campora. A Campora could shoot. And the less said about that, the better. Bastoni, a willing runner from deep. Bastoni's ball in. Jassi. The man who pulls the strings for Spezia. This is Enzola. Good take. Hakimi did well. Enzola inadvertently put a hand into the face there of Barella. Well attacked by Hakimi. Brozovic with the set piece. Gagliardini was climbing. Gagliardini and Ismaili have stayed. This is Brozovic. And still Brozovic. Well watched by Providel. The deflection certainly took the sting out of the effort, but it might have imparted some spin on it. Straight up in the air by Brozovic. Out by Ismaili. On by Bastoni. That's what he needs to produce plenty more after the break. If they are to beat me. This time we're back underway. Win on the same match day. We saw that in midweek as well. Also have come in that window. 16 of 30 in total. Under too much pressure either. Hakimi giving chase. Hakimi got there. This was Hakimi showing his pace. Bastoni went shoulder to shoulder with the Moroccan. Boria graduates now playing in the Italian top flight. Bastoni's cross. 
And it out. Barella might have been caught. Lukaku had an advantage there. But the whistle's gone because Barella is the man that's penalised. Yes, releasing Hakimi. This is better from Inter. Ashraf Hakimi! What a goal that is! Inter producing three memorable touches. And with just that, they're able to unlock Spezia. All it required was a flash of inspiration, a sharp shift in tempo. And Hakimi with a superb strike. Lovely hold up play from the weight on the pass from Lautaro Martinez. And even the first touch from Hakimi, Kaku in the middle, the flag goes up. Instead, it's Sensi. That was a chance. The whistle eventually goes. The flag had gone up prior to that. Lukaku. Herzi did well. Easy enough for Milan Skriniar. Then finishing the season with plenty of clean sheets. Well judged by Terzi. Right in the challenge. Good ball in. Bastoni, wrong side. It's a great challenge from Hakimi on the cover. Finally, Spezia got in behind him. This is Ricci arriving. He's away from Sensi momentarily. Deola's set piece. Enzo Laz header. Unable to work the goalkeeper. Well, he was left under. Stood up a good cross. Bastoni did well. Found himself just between Lukaku and Young. Lautaro Martinez again. Hakimi can cross. Instead, it's Sensi. It caught Enzo Lara on the chest. Although his body language did suggest for a moment that he was looking suspiciously guilty. He stopped, looked at the referee. Inter almost seemed convinced. Sensi clearly on side, just there. Does it catch the right arm? Or is there a piece of the chip? Up steps Romelu Lukaku! And Inter do have their second. Number 11 for him. Successful spot kick against Napoli, and now he's put away this penalty too. And now he's just one behind the league's top scorer. It breaks for Bastoni. It's his ball in, and they've got to go with Piccoli. Handanovic furious. It won't count much towards the result, but Spezia half the deficit. Roberto Piccoli latching onto the cross. And having scored earlier in the season in the Coppa Italia, now he's on target in Serie A. Very well to intervene. With Titi. PK. Cedric, what are you thinking? Well, the time has arrived to start taking risks. They may well be happy just to level this.